Hello everybody, my name is Mathis and welcome to Attack on Titan, the game. Um, I know a little bit about Attack on Titan, I've seen a couple of episodes, it's something that's on my must watch list, but I never fully watched it, but the game came out and the gameplay looked really fun. So I ended up picking it up and I figured why not share this game with those who may be interested in watching. And of course, if you watch the anime or have the game, then I'm curious to see what your thoughts are on the game in the comment section below. This is not gonna be a full series unless people really, really want it as I always do. I just wanna do a one or two episode, see what you think, see what I think, and then go from there. I'm excited because it seems cool and I'm down to play. All right, I'm playing on PC and I am playing with a controller plugged in because I hear that the, uh, that the uh, the keyboard and mouse controls are like fucking god awful. So um, I was hoping there was gonna be a, like a, a camera thing. There, that's what I'm looking for. Inverted Y, Y, because I'm crazy is basically why. Um, I need to play with inverted settings. Embark on survey missions with friends, play through the original story. So we're playing through attack mode. We'll see how it goes. It looked neat and all the reviews I read were thumbs up. So let's check it out. I expect I'll know what happened at the beginning because I've watched the first couple of episodes. Titans first appeared in this world over 100 years ago. That's honestly not that long ago. The grand scheme, yeah, they, the Titans brute strength completely outclassed the average person. Humanity was shoved to the brink of extinction. The survivors built three stalwart walls, Maria, Rose, and Cena to repel the Titans. I mean, I don't think walls repel titans. They kind of just, you know, like, they hold them off. Repelling them means, like, scaring them off. And secure territory for humanity's safety. Shit, man. However. Bum, bum, bum. So, the day, people so, the game is automatically in Japanese with English subtitles. There is no English dub option. Just so you know. Just trust me. I much prefer prefer what like dub when I'm playing a video game. <gasps> Yo, dude, that guy is smoking hot. But um So the, I I don't know if they they may have explained it in the manga at this point. Um, but, you know, as far as I know, and in the first season of the show, they really don't explain yet what Titans are, where they come from. All we know is they're giant, they look like humans, and, uh, they eat people. A hole in the wall. That is correct. He did kick a hole in the wall. The sudden appearance of the Colossal Titan brought the wall crashing down with it. Humanity's century-long peace. Well, that's what happens, I guess. Humanity yielded to the Titan's assault and abandoned the outermost wall, while Maria losing a fifth of its population and a third of its territory in the process. Damn! Humanity's domain receded all the way to Wall Rose. Well, I feel like... But this setback also roused humanity from its slumber. Well, were we napping? I feel like this is a bad time to nap. Wall, the three gigantic walls that surround humanity's domain, each wall is named after a goddess. The outermost wall is known as Wall Maria, the middle is Rose, further in is Sina, the royal capital where the aristocracy lives is located in the center of the walls. Each of three walls has protrusions where cities have been built to the north. Alright, let's just get in there. Two years later, damn. <laughs> Game looks really pretty. <coughs> I'll give it that. Typical angry anime soldier man. I'm ready. 
I'm ready to play video games. The basics of the omnidirectional mobility start with movement. So this is like the omnidirectional thing basically allows like Spider-Man like movement in the show and whatnot. So let's just go. Success! I moved! Press X to fire anchor. Oh damn! So it's straight up very Spider-Man like. I feel like I probably won't need to hit the hit the ground very often. Blasting gas will allow you to move at high speeds. Make the most of your limited supply. So we have a limited supply of gas. Last thing I wanted to run out of gas. Alright, cool. I like that. So gas is what's letting me boost around. Oh, man. Chance against Titans without a solid command of omnidirectional mobility. I gotta admit, man. That's really cool. Like, that is... That is the best Spider-Man movement since Spider-Man 2. Like, it looks like it hooks onto real things. Which is really awesome. Ah, that's really cool! I'm into it! Alright, we've arrived at the target. I can't do anything. Bet the, you bet we'll make fine decoys. That's nice. Thank you. Alright, small titan first. Press RB when a titan is near to switch to combat mode. Pressing X will fire an anchor into a titan body part, beginning omnidirectional mobility combat. While in this state, L can be used for rotation, while A can be used for boosted movement. During omnidirectional mobility... Wait, can we go back? What is it? Right bumper. Uh, during the combat, you can rush toward the titan by not using L. You can attack a titan's body parts by rushing close to it and pressing Y before there is a collision. Attacking while rushing after using A for a speed boost will allow you to do massive damage. That is that is not sinking into my bread, on my brain. You can use R to toggle between body parts. You wish to target and press X once again to fire an anchor into that new body part. However, constant rotation and boosting will put strain on the anchors. Be careful as they may come loose. All right, so we need to go into combat mode, like so. And we pop an anchor. We charge forward by not doing anything, and then we hit Y right beforehand. Okay, I get it. Okay, that's actually not that complicated when put in practice. But it's when it's not, in, when it's reading it didn't make any goddamn sense to me. What do you mean too slow, motherfucker? That's just learning. Larger Titan, okay. Enter combat mode. Woo! It kind of gives you a little bit of a heads up. Um, like right when you're about to hit it, it does that. Okay, I'm fucking up somehow. Oh, I gotta, I gotta toggle first. All right, fire new anchor. Okay. Okay, cool. They're just they're making me do the charging things and all that stuff. Neat. I'm into it. Attack with blades and blast gas and you'll uh, use them both up. Blade replacement and gas replenishment are crucial when it comes to surviving battles. Okay. Let's do some combat drills. And what I've said is up to you to decide when you resupply. So I'm assuming that over there is resupply. So blue is resupply. They've got gas. They've got people with blades. Logisticians have appeared around the battlefield. That's cool. So I'm going to have to like... I can't just take out a bunch of titans, I'm going to have to resupply. Pressing B near one will allow you to replenish items. Items held can be used by pressing up. And left right can also be used to switch. Got it. Your gas will deplete during omnidirectional mobility and you will be unable to perform various actions if it runs out. Additionally, your blades will also be consumed as you continue to attack enemies. Use items at appropriate times to replenish your depleted equipment. Alright, let's go, go, let's go to one right now. All right, there we go. So yeah, it's straight up, it's actually like actually Spider-Man because I can't do omnidirectional if there's no trees around. That's fucking cool. What'd you give me? You gave me some gas. All right, cool. Swap blades. Okay. Select gas. Replenish gas. 
All right. Assemble. Assemble! A little bit of a boost. Look at all those people. Final lesson, you'll you use everything you learn on Titan. Multiple targets will appear, strike as many as you can, and all the time in the time allotted. Okay, cool, I'm into it. Let's fucking do it, man. Oh, they're all they're actually all over the place. Let's do it. I don't know. That was awesome. I don't know what that nape thing was. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We're all over the place. Down he goes. And then we can just get the hell out. That is awesome. I I'm curious. What happens if I take out a leg? Nothing. So why would I ever take out... Well, I'm sure there's a reason to take out a leg. Maybe in, like, normal combat? But right now, it doesn't seem like there does... It doesn't seem to matter. Why are we not moving? We're, we're boosting in the wrong way. So I'm gonna have to, like... Like, do that. And then we move in. Beautiful. Let's get him. Fuck yeah, Nape! Let's nape his ass! Nape the grape! Here. And then, I wonder if there's like combos for not hitting the ground as well. I'm not gonna bother like stopping if I don't have to. Beautiful. I feel like... I don't know how many I've uh, destroyed. Strike as many limbs as possible in the allotted time. Uh, does, he, does he die? It doesn't look like he died. So, taking out a leg probably does something in real combat, but since these are dummies, it doesn't make any goddamn sense. And once I get used to the combat, it'll probably flow a little bit more. Honestly, I feel like I'm not doing terribly for my first go. This is actually neat. <laughs> I'm actually really impressed with it so far. Hey, how dare you attack this guy? I'll take care of him, motherfuckers. I like how they're all at like five or six are getting are attacking that one. But really, it just it took it takes one fell swoop. Let's uh, let's see what this guy's got here. I'd love to restock on swords, but this is not swords, so that's fine. And he just leaves after that. He's like, "Fuck you! I've only got enough for just one." And I'm just bouncing afterward. So we got two more. Oh, we can definitely get all of them. All right, we did it. Never mind, they got him. Apparently, the NPCs are actually doing work. It better be me. I better be the top performer. Is that me? Am I Eren? I must be. That looks like me. Good job, you did it, man. Motivation to train harder? How? I don't need to train any harder, man. I'm fucking number one. I am number one. Aw, poor little kid. He's mad. That's a cocky ass attitude. Nanara, Why would you want to be put in the police regiment? You'll probably just end up dying. Oh, the best students get put behind the walls. Oh. 
So bad students get put out there to fight the- That doesn't make any sense! Why would you put the bad students up against the Titans? Oh shit, he grabbed him by the nips! Never grab somebody by the nips, that shit's sensitive! <laughs> Man, he got serious. He grabbed the nipples. Gene's nips were in danger. Alright, more intense. So we fast forward to an actual fight. That would be good. Ooh, I got an S? A? S? Does it matter? Really? I got an A? I'll take an A. Players will be rated depending on their actions during battle. These ratings determine the amount of experience earned. Oh, it's experience. Does that mean I level up and shit? Oh, I do level up! I straight up level up! After enough experience has been earned, regiment skill and a character's soldier skill will increase. Increasing regiment skill causes new equipment to appear in camp and unlocks new equipment for development. Increasing soldier skill will allow characters to learn skills. You can learn more about what each character's skill does under player information in the pause screen. Alright. Aaron has acquired the, a new skill, Swoop. Allows for a, pot a powerful downward strike by attacking the enemy from above. He's got something that decreases leadership, though. What does that do? Still, I feel like I did really well. Regiment funds. You can earn regiment funds by being victorious in battle. Additional rewards can also be gained by subjugating many titans. Regiment funds are used for purposes such as developing new equipment in camp. All right. A little RPG toss in here. I'm into it. You can earn materials by being victorious in battle. Additional materials can also be gained by destroying Titan body parts during battle. Materials are used for purposes such as developing new equipment in camp. Got it. Small piece of iron. Uh, small piece of iron. Blah, blah, blah. We got some shit to build stuff with. Restorative has been added to items usable in battle, which I'm assuming is like a health potion. A regiment created the cadet corpse. In, uh, a regiment created in order to train recruits, hoping to learn blah blah corpse. Yeah, all right, whatever. I just want to know. Sweet, we graduate. Devote your lives to the cause. Well, we're working on it, man. So the, the Garrison Regiment reinforces walls and protects towns. Scout ventures outside the walls into Titan territory. And the military police, which maintains order in the king's name. So basically, me, medium cush job, really cush job. You're probably going to die in the woods by eating, by, eating by eating by a Titan, but hey, you'll be a hero for doing it. And of course, only the most cushy jobs go to the best people. Damn. She gets to be that? Alright. I love the way he's saying some of these names. Shit. You finally made it, Aaron. And I'm gonna be honest, that face right there doesn't look like a happy one. I don't know if you want to feast on Titans. I feel like it's probably a poor decision. <laughs> Begins tomorrow. Be ready. Well, I don't know what that means, but I'm sure. Camp. You can use various facilities and speak to characters in camp. Approach a facility chief or character and press A to speak to them. Speaking to a character with a question mark showing will begin an event. Fuck it. Let's do it. Heh. <laughs> <laughs> I can finally live in the interior. I mean, I got chosen to as well, but I'm not gonna... Bump ba dump bump, gonna drink some booze. Work your ass off, everybody, and you'll get easy jobs. That's what the game's teaching us.
お前おかしいとは思わねえのか巨人から遠ざかるために巨人殺しの技を磨くなんてよ That's what I'm saying, Aaron. 今さら何言ってんだこれが現実なんだよ俺のためにもこのクズ野郎 Wow, scumbag, huh? 4年前の作戦で人口の2割以上を失って答えは出たんだ人勝てないと思うから諦めるのか確かにここまで人類は敗北してきたそれは巨人に対して無知だったからだ負けはしたが得た情報は確実に次の希望につながる、well, what was that? お前は何十万の犠牲で得た戦術の発達を放棄して内地に引きこもるのか冗談だろ All right, well. そんなに外に出たいなら一人で行けよ死に急ぎやろうが俺は巨人を駆逐して狭い壁の中から出る調査兵団に入ってな I mean, it's admirable, man. It's admirable. I, I understand. Like, he wants to be a hero and shit. What does talking to people do? <laughs> I finally have full soldier and food won't be a problem ever again. Is that all you think about? If I get promoted, I could even get a massive pile of meat. m w a h a h a h a Alright, so just talking to people doesn't really seem to do anything. Hey, anyway, we'll talk to somebody else just in case. Aaron, if I join the scout regiment, then so will I. Oh, if I do, then she will. If you join another regiment, then I'll join too. You know I didn't ask you to do that. You'd die in no time if it wasn't by your side. I don't want to lose my family ever again. Alright, well, fuck it. I'm glad I was somehow able to recruit,、uh, to graduate. Aaron, you're entering the scout regiment, right? Yeah, that's always been my goal. That's why I trained this far. I finally have the strength to beat those bastards. I don't ever want to feel that way again. Because of my weakness, really. I failed that day. Are we gonna relive that day? I know what day he's talking about. Apparently, we are. Yo, man, here comes the、uh, Titans with the, the smiley Titan. Why are we just so happy to be alive, really? Okay, he. It's just so happy to be alive! Shit. Girl, y o u about to have a fine ass dinner, is all I'm saying. A little rump roast. You know? Is this screaming gonna work? Oh, damn, son. Close your eyes, boy. Don't look at that. Ever since that day, I knew I wanted to risk my life. Yo, straight up, we got a Dragon Ball Z looking motherfucker here. A little Broly action almost. Well, minus the super long hair. Just got the muscles. Dude is just there to fuck shit up, and he breathes out some steam. Ain't that some shit? <laughs> I mean, he fucking just did a football ass charge right down the line of defense. This is where the anime hero swears vengeance. See, there it is. Always. Hey, back to happiness. Various facilities exist within camp, such as the equipment supply station. Be sure to begin developing new equipment before you set off to the next battle. Alright, homie. I'll start developing new equipment. You can't tell me not to. 
Hey man, I'm here to develop new equipment. This is where your combat equipment is stored. You can also forge equipment or create new equipment for materials here. Well, let's... At the equipment supply station, you can choose between new developments and equipment modifications. Select like new developments to create equipment by using raw materials. Uh, Alright, we can modify. How about new developments? What we got? Blades. Blades are rated by sharpness, blade length, and durability. Sharpness affects attack power. Length affects combat range. High durability makes it harder for the blade to break. Scabbards and canisters are rated by gas capacity, pressure, and blades remaining. When gas capacity is high, the maximum level of gas meter will be increased. Pressure will affect, I'm assuming, movement speed. Blades remaining will affect the maximum number of blades that can be held. Omnidirectional mobility gear is rated by real speed, anchor range, and I, that all makes sense. Okay, cool. So we can go through all this stuff and start making shit. And it shows us immediately what's better overall. Right now, it looks like first generation blade is better. We have six, we might as well start it. Done. We'll equip it. Um, then we can start doing some other shit. I want pure improvements right now. So why don't we go with gas capacity right out the gate? Yeah, we'll go for it. Boom. We'll equip it. I like it. And then I'm out of everything else, it looks like. I lack the funds. Oh, I need money. All right, that's fine. Cash in. Blades? Oh, I can just sell blades. So I might as well just, like, sell them? Goodbye, training blades. Goodbye, training scabbard. Can I make anything else, then? I don't have anything else, it looks like. But I can modify my equipment, so if I really particularly like something, then I can modify it. This is where we keep all sorts of materials. They can be used to create new equipment or reinforce old equipment. Do you need anything? Use regiment funds in the material acquisition depot to acquire materials. So I can buy... I'm, a seri I'm assuming I can just buy raw materials for money here. Easy enough. No one gotta tell me twice, fam. Mathis is the king. That's an exclamation mark. What is... What is what's this? Oy. You got it, maggot! This is the real deal. Don't slack off now just because you've graduated from training. Yes, sir. Starting tomorrow, you'll be fighting Titans as a full soldier. You think you're ready? Speaking to characters with a blank mark displayed above them will prompt you to proceed to the next battle. Selecting top choice. Select the top choice if you are done preparing your equipment. Yeah, let's do it. Fuck it. I'm ready for a fight. I want to fight some real titans before we end this episode, man. Giant humanoid beings that feed on humans. While they have varied heights and features, the majority have bodies that resemble masculine human bodies. They have no reproductive organs, and it is unknown how they reproduce. They show no interest in non-human creatures. Even if parts of their bodies are destroyed, they are regenerated in about one to two minutes. However, if major damage is dealt to a titan's nape, area below its head... Oh, that's what the nape is. It dies and does not regenerate. After dying, titan bodies evaporate and disappear. Good to know. Chapter 1, Return of Despair. It's also going to be the name of my biography. Huh? He made up his mind, damn it. He doesn't want to be a cushy job. He wants to go and risk his life. Yo, girl, don't be stealing meat. What? It's okay, we'll divide it up later. Besides, we'll have more beef and lamb. We'll take our lambs. Alright, let's get to work. Oh, shit. We're cutscening. Five years. Wait, five years later? What? Oh, we just like talking. Oh, yeah, because it was two years after I started my training. Three years later, I graduated. We're fighting back. Shit's going, going good. Uh, how? Excuse me? Yeah, that's my reaction would be. It's hot? Well... Dude, dude, just a titan just fucking appeared in front of your faces. That didn't take long at all. Humanity's fighting back. We're winning. Poof! Bang! Well. Mama! Alright, fucker, it's time to go.
Dude's pissed. Hey man, nice ass. You got yourself a fine ass. All right, let's go for the arm. Titans and battles. Titans consist of various parts. To subjugate a titan, you must destroy its nape, but it is difficult to aim directly for this part of the titan. It is important to first take measures such as slicing off a titan's legs to restrict its movements or slicing off its arms to leave it unable to attack. Titan body parts are unique in that they gradually heal any damage done to them. Also, titans will eventually regenerate any parts that are destroyed. This makes it important to both deal large amounts of damage through attacks unleashed at high speed, as well as destroy part parts quickly enough. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, some Titans produce materials when destroyed, so aim for those. If you have the misfortune of being captured by a Titan, press Y rapidly to try and escape. Boom! He's looking at his arm. He's very confused. I would be too. Wouldn't you be? Fuck yeah, destroy a leg. I'm into it. I'm, I'm really good at destroying legs. Boom. You got no legs, motherfucker. We're going in for nape destruction. Mm. We completely subjugated the asshole, and I'm covered in blood. It's kind of awesome. More for our match. Okay, well, I mean, that was only one Titan, dude. I would relax. I wouldn't worry about it. He's about to fucking kick in another hole. Yeah, just like that, and you just fucking took damage that I have to now heal. Yo, that is a creepy-ass looking Titan. It's like a baby Titan with a bobblehead. That, oh my god, if a Titan attacks, if a, if a Titan attack brings you to a near death state, your movement will be restricted in various ways. For example, you'll not be able to move as quickly and you will not be able to jump. The near death state can be cured by waiting for enough time to pass or by using a restorative. You will enter focus time if you are attacked by a Titan while in near death state. Time will slow around you uh, during focus time, so try to avoid Titan's attacks before the focus meter is depleted. Be careful. Blah, blah, blah. Right, we're just dodging out the way. We're gonna switch up and anchor up on his arm. We're gonna go boom. Okay, we have to use the restorative first, apparently. And now we're gonna go in. Eat shit, nerd. Can't stop me. Yeah! Seriously, man? this <laughs> The combat feels incredibly good. Nope, I'm going for the freaking the leg, man. You can't stop this shit. I'm going for the nape. I'm going for the naple. Nape arena. That was a medium titan. I mean, honestly, he was kind of small in my opinion, but that's okay. All right, that's looking that <clears throat> Your heads are swapped is what I'm trying to say. This one is bigger than the others. Can I take him alone? I mean, I don't know. Tony and Sasha have appeared. Well, I don't know what that means for anyone. The way he runs is incredible. He's very excited. Some allies are team members who you can work together with. Some uh, team members will act accordingly to your orders. Instructions include Fallout, Escort, and Focus. These can be toggled using this. Fan out will cause them to automatically fight nearby Titans. Escort will cause team members to protect important allied soldiers. From Titans and Focus will cause team members to attack the same Titan as you attack. Uh, as the number of your team members grows, their overall offensive will increase. Members include characters who will give you items when you stand still, as well as characters who will use items. Aim for a Titan in charge. Okay, I don't know what just happened there, but nothing as far as... I think we did it. And now I'm having them guard. And I'm just gonna fucking kill him myself. Get him. Get him! You can't stop this shit. I'm gonna go and have them fan out. I don't know if it freaking matters. But I'm gonna have him fan out regardless. Oh, there's some shit in his leg! I don't know why there's some shit in his leg, but there is. Got it. Well, we're gonna go and, and finish up the last hit here before I switch out blades. We definitely need to switch, switch out our blades here. Our gas is fine, and some logisticians have appeared on the battlefield, which is gonna be valuable. 
I don't know if I'd say I owe them one, man, because I feel like you did most of the work. Is that it? Did we do it? No shit, there's a hole in the wall, but I have this thing about wanting to kill all of them. Don't mind me. I'm gonna be reckless. See you later. Bye. Well, I mean, I feel like, you know, if you kill it, another one will just show up. Also, that was an unnecessary spinny landing. Hey, what up, fam? How you doing, boo? Alright, let's stop it then. Shit's hot. Like my ass. Okay, what am I doing? Switch. Okay, I think I just fell off. Okay, I did fall off. Combat mode, and we're anchoring. Okay, it's protected by steam. Thank you for making me do that game. Give it a taste of mounted cannons, of course. Let's go for it, man. Mount the cannons. That'll work. Be near cannon while I had to use it. Mime the sights, fire a shell. Okay, that's fine. Enter the cannon, boom. Are we just attacking its goddamn face? We're just gonna hit it in the face a whole bunch, apparently. Looks like it's doing a really good job. He looks like he's having a great time. I mean, you know, if that's what you want to do. I just gotta keep hitting it in the face. Okay. Thank God one shell to his elbow is his actual weakness. Now let's put a shell in his mouth next time. It's a little bit sensitive aiming with the controller. Come on. That's fine, it worked. It's regenerating. I'm, I'm watching it regenerate. Just keep on going. Come on. Good. I gotta wait now. Eh. Good shot. Good shot. Do I just need to get the red down? Because if I just need to get the red health bar down, we're, we're almost there. Come on. No. No siree, Bobberino. Down. Boom. About 17,000 shells to the face later and a little bit of twitching and he's done. Did you get him? No? Alright, you're getting blasted back, that's fine. And he's gone. He, she disappeared much like he appeared, man. お前が倒しちまったのか。違う。5年前と同じだ。あいつは突然現れて突然消えた。何謝ってんだ。俺たちなんて全く動けなかった。何する。超大型巨人出現時の作戦はすでに開始している。直ちに本部に戻れ。You in trouble, fam? Uh-uh, you broke the rules. But that's where we're gonna stop this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you wanna see more Attack on Titan, let me know. I am definitely gonna play more of this game on or, or off camera. Don't matter to me. I hope you guys enjoyed it. 
If you did, I'm looking forward to seeing what your thoughts are. It's got, honest to God, man. Uh, you will receive additional regiment funds, it's fine. Honest to God, the, the movement is like freaking mwah. It's freaking beautiful, the movement. So good. Um, we got a bunch of materials for getting S rank. It's great. Uh, but we're gonna stop here. I'll see all of you guys next time. Bye-bye.